the hope is to be able to use these discs and apply them to a chronic wound. So it's a little There's bit farther down this side. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Fluorescing. The unveiling of this renovated molecular lab represents an investment in science, higher education, and as I said, our nation's future. There's a lot of team research going yeah, on now. Yeah, we, we incorporate teams in a lot of ways. In Sacramento State, with the help of our partners in the community and in government, we are proud to offer the practical education and the excellent programs that can unlock those careers. The Chimera Lab gives our university a state-of-the-art facility that provides hands-on learning experiences to prepare students for the jobs of tomorrow. Okay. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Yeah. This is exciting, and whenever anyone has a breakthrough, uh, I think it just excites everyone else. This is thoroughly wonderful. It's what we need, and particularly at Sac State because it is a fine learning institution. And what it does is separate the DNA based on the size. And it's really the lab experience, looking at um, the cells, and look at the microscopes, and trying to do all these kinds of things, and really seeing what happens. Those are experiences that can lead you to something that's going to be, uh, in essence, uh, something we can use for the future.